Good morning and welcome to Vlogmas Day 19. Good morning everyone, so welcome to Vlogmas Day 19 for a start. How are we even this far in? I've uploaded every single day for 19 days. The first week was a struggle and felt like it was forever. But then now it's just become part of my routine and I think I am going to be able to do this for a long time. Fingers crossed, don't keep me to that. Why have I just said that? Whilst my vlog's uploading, I just thought I'd show you this. I uh, moved the little terrarium thing from off my desk hanging there. And I just put it there just because I thought it looked cute. I kind of like it. My um, vlog is currently uploading, so I'm still waiting for that to take. It says 28 minutes remaining, which I don't know why, because it never takes that long. But whilst that is doing that, I'm going to head into the kitchen and make myself some cereal. I also need to wash a bunch of my shit because I haven't done my washing in a while, so... Gotta clean some bowls and plates, I guess. Look at that. What a pretty sky. What better way to do the pots than to listen to Harry Styles whilst doing the pots, you know? Tell me something, tell me something you don't know nothing. Just pretend to me something, tell me something. Oh, tell me something I don't already know. Oh, tell me something I don't already know. Selfish, I know. I don't really want to see you with him. Maybe one day you'll call me and tell me that you saw too. Alright, so I literally don't even think we're gonna go to like Instagram shoot because it's dark outside now. Um has basically started doing makeup looks for Instagram. And I said I'd wait for it, and then I waited a bit, and I'm like, I probably shouldn't have waited. I probably should have just gone on myself. So I think what we're gonna do instead is go shopping. But I'm still freaking waiting for her. She takes the piss doing everything. Um, I'm now catching up on some YouTube videos. Don't really know what today's vlog's gonna be. Maybe we'll go Instagram shooting tomorrow. Has is currently putting eyeshadow on and doing other makeup things. Right, Has is finally done pissing around, doing a makeup, playing games. Um, <laughs> it's now midnight and... Get lost! <laughs> Actually, go suck yourself off. Now, we're going to Westfields. Are we going to Westfields? Just... <laughs> Am I in shot? Yeah. What the fuck are Yeah, we are going to Westfields. <laughs> I just fell into mirror what I did here. They are there. I've got to get my vitamins before we leave. Woo! <laughs> oh, my very own Christmas love. Yeah. Adios, amigos. Tango for all. You feeling fine for the vlog? I am in perfect health. I had a KFC, sobered myself up, and now I'm ready to take on the night. We love a queen in the fur. Everyone loves the queen in the fur. Bye. 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 Let's go Westfields finally. All right. Field have added these lovely blue Christmas lights. Love them. Very festive. Very sweet. Love the police. Right, we've just arrived at Westfields now. I always grab my hat whenever I start a clip and it really bugs me when I'm editing it back. We've arrived at Westfield. We're gonna go get food first. Are you having burger? I've never had it yet. Has has never had Burger King before, so I'm gonna introduce her to the new found love of my life. And I cannot wait. Right, I got myself a chicken royale meal as always. Has also got a chicken royale meal for the first time. 
We'll let you know how she feels about it, but I'm so hungry, so I'm gonna stop vlogging and eat this. Right, we finished up at Burger King now, Has. How did you like your first Burger King? I actually really, really enjoyed it. It is so good. So I've converted Has into a Chicken Royale meal, so that's what you'll be getting on your break now. Yes, it will We're just uh, walking around Westfields now. I've not actually ever walked fully like around Westfields properly, so first time for everything you know, walking around Westfields, love life. Has is gonna try loads of shit on her, I know that I'm just gonna be stuck there like. So you're gonna try like No, I'm not. Right, I literally can't buy any more jackets, but I really like this one. It's so, so cute. Hmm. Right, so we've come into Urban Outfitters, and I'm going to pick an outfit for Haz, and Haz is going to pick an outfit for me. And then we're going to see who is um, successful. How are you feeling about this challenge? Why Let's go. Boyfriend buys my uh, Urban Outfit. <laughs> Why, I know you really <laughs> I'm in the changing rooms now. I've got a bunch of stuff that me and has collectively chose. She is in the other changing rooms and then we're gonna put all the stuff on, show each other, just see how this goes. I really do not know how off this stuff's gonna look. Hopefully she's done a good job. Right, so I picked up these trousers, they're pink corduroy. But I actually think they look so cool. Good luck, bitch. Remember to film. Okay. <laughs> They like a baby pink colour, but I think they're so, so cool. Hmm. Might have to um, do a cheeky purchase. I really like this champion jumper, but the lighting in this changing room is awful, but I really like this champion jumper. However, it's just too big, but it's the only size I've got left. It's a large, and I probably would have got a medium normally. But I really like it. There's matching tracksuit bottoms to it as well. And these are so, so nice. Like, I folded the t-shirt jumper up, so if it were a little bit smaller, I think this would look so, so cool. Has is doing well so far. Shit. Right, I really like this outfit as well. This is just a stussy t-shirt. And then it has stuff say on the back. Um, and then these blue jeans. I really like these jeans, actually. They're quite a nice fit. Right, I actually really like this jumper off, but I'm not really feeling it when it's on. It's just a green stussy jumper. But this is like... I don't know if the material picks up. Super cool, but that's the idea. I like it off, but not on. I really like this off as well, but I'm not feeling the colour I'm against my skin. It makes me look extra pale. I'm literally so confused. Look how big these trousers are. Like, this is the smallest size. Like, this outfit had potential to be looking cool, but the sizes are so weird. But look at that. I think this is the winning outfit, not gonna lie. I love both these trousers and this t-shirt. Might have to buy these. Let me know what you think in the comments below. But I think these trousers are really cool. They are women's, but you know what? 2018, ladies and gentlemen, who cares? That was actually quite a success. I am actually buying two of the things, the pink trousers and the white stussy t-shirt. The rest of it, I'm not gonna get. I was contemplating getting, where is it? I am um, contemplated getting that, but it's like my Tommy Hilfiger one. Like, I really like the color gray. I'm not too fussed about the brand. I like the color gray. And then I realized that my Tommy Hilfiger one is literally the exact same part when it says Tommy Hilfiger. So I'm not gonna get that. Beanies just really don't suit me. And then they were just really freaking big. Um, I like the blue jeans, but they're a bit basic. Don't like that. And like I said, if I'm not getting the gray tracksuit t-shirt, then I'm not gonna get the bottoms either. I think this one really fits. 
Right, we finished up. I do that with my hat every single clip. <laughs> we finished up in Westfields now. We've been just into Poundland across the road from Westfields. Got some essentials. When I say essentials, I got like spaghetti, crisp, nothing that's really that essential. How's this affair there? What? Since when's that been there? Anyway, we finished up in Westfields and other places and Poundland and stuff. We're gonna head back now. Um, I feel like we're gonna get run over. Right, we're not. We're heading back now, finally. Oh, it's fine, that's honestly. I got the pink trousers and a white t-shirt and now I've got 20 pounds left. Love that. Um, I got some lovely tins of spaghetti from Poundland. Main bit of the purchase. I got some snaps because these crisps are so freaking good. I bought some cheap ass noodles because I'm on a budget. I got some Terry's chocolate oranges because you know what, kicking off the festive fun. These remind me of Christmas. Gonna eat the full pack probably by tomorrow. And finally, some mini Yazoo milkshakes. Then you saw what I got from Urban because I showed it here in the changing room. So I'm not gonna show that. Just gonna put that straight in my wardrobe, but that's all I got from Urban Outfitters. Right, I almost forgot to tell you something. Let me bond my glasses on. Um, so when I were out shopping in New Look in Westfield, I picked up some nail varnishes. Depending on how long you've been watching my channel, I always used to paint one hand like with black matte black nail varnish. I haven't done it in literally forever. I've still got that nail polish somewhere. It's on one of my shelves. But the other day I was shopping in Shoreditch and I were in Box Park. And this guy served me in a shop and I was like, oh my god, this guy is so fucking cool. Like his outfit were cool, he looks cool. And then as I were putting my shit in my bag, I was like, oh my god, he's got his nails painted. And they were like a matte grey colour and it looks so so cool. So I was shopping in New Look today and I went past these. Now this is it gonna focus? I hate that you have to do this. This is like a pebble grey colour. I bought this matte top coat which makes any literally any like nail varnish matte which I thought was so so cool and they just look cool like they're in like a super cool packaging so I'm gonna put this on my nails and just you know watch some YouTube videos but I forgot to mention it in the vlog so that's what I'm gonna do I love the smell of nail varnish so much and it's so fucking fun to pick it off anyway I'm gonna um, paint my nails right I'm watching Joe's <laughs> Joe's vlog um this is the colour without the matte stuff on it, as you can see. I don't know if it's wet or if it's just shiny because that's what sort of um, like consistency it is, but I don't want to risk it and touch it. But yeah, only doing one hand because why not? This is honestly the coolest thing, like I literally just put it on and it's gone matte. Like, can you see that? Like, this one's still shiny and then the, re the rest have gone matte. Like, look. That is so fucking cool, how does that even work? This is actually going to be near enough impossible to take on the train with me. Like, it's alright taking it on the train with me and once I get to Sheffield it's fine, but like, getting it from my apartment to the train station, like, these bags are big, like, they're not just like, average bags, like, they're the biggest Urban Outfitters bags that we sell, and it's full, and I've got two of them, and then I'm going to have my clothes as well. Like, I really, what, how, ugh. Currently watching Claudia Salewski's vlogs, I've just paused it, but look how messy my wardrobe is. Like, it is such a mess, especially up there. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go through every single piece of my clothes and just literally depop everything that I don't wear. Like, I'm not going to be like, oh, I might wear this. Like, some of that shit has been in there and I've not worn for like a year, so it's just got to go because I can't deal with this situation right now. So... Maybe not by the time this vlog goes up, but sometime in the near future, I'm going to be putting a lot of shit on Depop, and I just want to get rid of it, so there'll be a link at some point. I'm going to sort this out now. It's a quick before, because then at least I'll have to do something and clean something to make it look like there's an after. And after. <laughs> Sorry, I had a cough. How's your an idiot? 
It's, oh, it's literally half past one in the morning and I've only just finished this. This is my pile of stuff that's going to depop. It were a lot bigger than that, but then Haz is not a good influence. She was like, no, keep it, keep it. And she also took some stuff for herself. Oh, sorry. Sad, dude. <laughs> what, Byron? Stop getting up all my crown. Mm. It's fine. At least I wasn't called Dermot. Radical. Can you imagine if I was called Dermot? That was one of my parents' choices. That's horrific. <laughs> I actually wish you never got that hat out of my room. You should have just gone in the bin. It's focusing on phone, not on you. On the phone? What phone? <laughs> I haven't got a phone. <laughs> Boy, I'm not phone. <laughs> Boy, I'm not phone. Boy, I'm not phone. Why are you not responding? What a phone has. No, I can't stand it. Right, just walk forward, drag your hand across the wall. That's not <laughs> yeah. a computer. I thought you were going to get iPhone. Like, God, we're not in the 1970s. Right. Jokes are really bad. He was a skater boy, she's a sailor. I love Avril Lavigne. <laughs> love Avril Lavigne, Joe. He was a skater boy, she's a sailor boy. I actually hate you. Yeah. <laughs> Can you imagine if I was called Dermot? Right. Have I mean, no. right, this is where I'm gonna go. Right. Hey, have. Really, really early, early, if you knock on my door, how's this going? No, I was just filming your crotch. Has is going home tomorrow morning. Has is going home tomorrow morning, and I'm going to be here all on my own because Freya's not here either. I said you can come home and play, but you didn't. No. No. <laughs> you need to go in. Why can't you go in? Because I thought the story hasn't finished. Right. Bye. How? Bye. Alright, so as you've just seen, Haz has headed to bed, which means I am going to also head to bed. It is currently 2am, um, actually it's 5 past 2, so I'm going to go to bed. My room is looking a lot tidier, which I am absolutely loving. I feel like the Christmas presents in the corner of my room were just cluttering it and it were really stressing me out. But yeah, I am going to go to bed. Everyone's gone home. Freya's not here, Haz is going tomorrow, Neve's going tomorrow, Andrea's in bloody... I thought I was going to say Thailand then, but she's not from Thailand, she's from Tenerife. Andrea is in Tenerife. Oh, my other roommates. These two girls that I've never, never even met, they are probably in Thailand. Um, he's, here, he's going home tomorrow. I don't have a clue where Joe is, and I am just going to be here on my own. Love that. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do tomorrow, but you'll have to wait and see for tomorrow's vlog. I love you all lots, and I will chat to you in the morning. Give this video a thumbs up for me being literally lonely. Good night.